Coming up next, the women's 1500 meters with Susie Hamilton as we continue our coverage of the Bruce Jenner Cementic Classic from San Jose, California. And now it's time for the women's 1500 meters. The world record was set in 1980, the American record by Mary Slaney in 1983. And there's a look at Susie Hamilton. Susie Hamilton, an outstanding NCAA competitor, says she's aiming for the Olympic trials, but needs this kind of race to get her ready. <laughs> and standing next to her, Maria Matola. We've been following her for a couple of years, and yet she is still in high school. Matola attending Springfield High School in Oregon, but an outstanding run for her to finish fourth in the World Championships 800 last year. And here's a look at the rest of the field. This is a strong field, including Yvonne Graham, better known perhaps as, as Yvonne Mai from East Germany, then Germany, now living and training in Austin, Texas. Alisa Hill has taken the early lead. You see Susie Hamilton now running fourth. Ruth Waisaki right alongside of her. And moving up on the outside is Ruth Waisaki, who told us she hopes that someone will take the pace out quickly, that she feels she needs a fast pace to let her strength come out. Waisaki, an American Olympian in 1984, who ran one of her best times ever just last week in the 800 meters, 202. So Lisa Hill, Maria Matola, Sissy St. Jem, Ruth Waisaki, Susie Hamilton. Several of the athletes in the field have great confidence in their finishing kick. Among them, Mutola, who it says, I believe in my kick. And also Susie Hamilton, who we've seen win many races coming from behind. Right around 64 seconds at the 400 meter mark. So they're on a very quick four minute, 1500 meter pace right now. And it's been Elisa Hill with the lead. But look at Mutola move up. Normally she doesn't run that close to the front, does she? Well, Matola can work on all sorts of tactics during these early season races, and she knows she's already been selected for her Olympic team from Mozambique, recently returned to Africa to take part in the Unity Games. Unity Games bringing together for the first time in three decades the African nations along with South Africa. It's Elisa Hill, Maria Matola, Susie Hamilton, and Sissy St. Jem. Currently one through four, here comes Ruth Waisaki now. Moving all the way up to third if she passes. Waisaki, who since running on the 1984 Olympics has had a baby boy and sells real estate in addition to her training. And she says it's interesting. She's now running the exact same workouts that she ran in 1984 when she shocked the world by beating Mary Slaney in the 1500 meters at the Olympic trials. With that great kick that Maria Matola has, if she can stay this close to the front, she's going to be in excellent position. But right behind her in third place is Susie Hamilton, who also has an excellent kick. Now, the pace has slowed considerably, 213 at the 800-meter mark, and it is developing into the kind of races you suggest where a finishing kick will make a difference. Yvonne Graham now fourth. Graham married to Jamaican hurdler Winthrop Graham one of the best 400 meter hurdlers in the world. Coming up on the outside, Dar Darcy Areola. Areola, the NCAA champion. Very impressive running from the front for Elisa Hill. Hill, who won the Pan American Games in this event last year, trying a new tactic for her. She usually has confidence in her kick. Alisa Hill holding on the lead, but here comes Maria Matola running right alongside of her. And the interesting thing will see, be to see how those behind, and that includes Yvonne Graham and Susie Hamilton, take advantage of the fact that Alisa Hill and Mutola were battling down that backstretch. Mutola with the lead, followed by Alisa Hill. Susie Hamilton now passing Yvonne Graham. That was an excellent move by Mutola because it's left the others a lot to do to catch up with her. They have to get all the way around Elisa Hill. 
Latola trying to hold on, but here comes Susie Hamilton. And she is not going to catch Maria Matola. It's Matola, followed by Susie Hamilton and Yvonne Graham. An excellent run by Maria Matola. Matola right around her personal best of 407, which she established two weeks ago. And really, it was her tactics that won the race for her. When we saw her last year, her first bit of international running, she was a bit inexperienced with tactics in races of this sort. Here, she moves very quickly by Elisa Hill who's now in second place, and that created a problem for the two athletes behind, Yvonne Graham and Susie Hamilton. They had to work all the way around Hill to try to catch up to Mutola. Meanwhile, Mutola was running away from them in the home stretch. A very strong runner, the fastest 800-meter runner in the field. She uses her kick to good advantage. Maria Mutola with a lifetime best of 407.28. Susie Hamilton, as she did in Mount Sac, a great finishing kick but not quite enough to catch Mutola. And Yvonne Graham was third.